I appreciate you joining me on another episode of Whiskey and Washers. I'm your host, Ryan. I'm drinking some rare breed tonight from the wild turkey family. Oh, it's delightful. I also got a bottle of uh, Kentucky Spirit, also from the wild turkey family. And both are delicious. If you'd like to uh, know what I think about them, man, check out some of my previous shows. Uh, I'm doing reviews on them, I'm comparing them. I'm going to tell you which one I prefer better, but I'm also going to let you know, hey, there's great qualities in both, and there is, man. There really is. So, I'm out here on an August evening. You can hear the cicadas in the background. I'm not even sure if you can hear me, but it is calm and cool, and you know what? I think it's time to really show off the washer... uh, Ugh. the washer skill tonight so it's going to be a little less bourbon a little more washers i don't know which one you're into but you're going to get both tonight if you're more into bourbon fan check out some of my last shows i'm also going to be doing a uh, little fireside chat talking about how you read bottles how to understand what a bottle is telling you but no wind a very cool evening man it's time to throw some washers right in the damn middle so I'm going to shoot nine washers per round till I hit 50 points. And my record for a washer thrown is 29. 29 washers to get to 50 points. And, I mean, these this is record-setting weather in terms of no wind, it's cool. Oh, it's just gorgeous. I have been drinking. This is show number, let's, I'm not even going to probably divulge that information but it's quite a few shows so hopefully my washers will pick up because one in and two on and there's uh, uh, that's poor that's five points and here's how we're gonna do it one through 20 right there 21 through 40 and then we're gonna pack up the other side back to 50 again the record is 29 washers so that's that's my record I don't know what the record is. Of course, thing is, my dad makes these washer boards, so the record probably is 29. Um, if you're thinking to yourself, what other washer boards are there? I actually have a great example. Well, you can go to Walmart and pick up some washers, but the other thing is, if you check out uh, the franchise on YouTube, which is For anyone not in Kansas, unfortunate, but that's the Chiefs YouTube page, uh, which they show, so they have a pre... Just check it out. It's awesome. Um, They actually have a washer tournament at the end of training camp with uh, staff and the general manager and the owner. So check that out. You'll see what washer boards you can actually buy uh, at a store. These were custom made. My dad used to make washers literally just like that because it's easy it's simple and it's quick but i'm not sure it rewards a good shot as much as my dad wanted it to so he ended up coming up with this uh this style and yeah i mean uh, honestly i can play on either one i got friends that have uh the store about ones and i'm i'm tough to beat on that as well (laughs) not to brag but I mean, so let's call it as it is. I'm tough to beat on, on washer boards. So, two in. I'm not showing it. Oh, three in and one on. You may be thinking to yourself, yeah, that ain't shit. Well, you're right. It's not. But 15 points, 18 washers thrown. It's hard to, it's hard to really focus as much as I want to with no reward. Like, I'll... I mean, I'm competitive. I enjoy winning. Who doesn't in life? Like, who doesn't like to win in life? Well, it's hard to uh, actually get those competitive juices flowing just shooting by myself as I am tonight. But at least I have a goal. I'm trying to get to 50 points in under 29 washers. It ain't going to happen this show because 15 points I've thrown 18 washers. I need 35 more points, and I only have 
what, 12 more washers, 10 more washers. The record's 29, so 11 more washers. I should probably think before I talk when I'm talking math, but I only have 11 more washers to get 35 points, so um, not going to happen. But at least I have that goal. And, God, no wind tonight. I mean, you think there's a lot of trees out here because you see them as you're looking back and forth, but it is a wide open uh, area out here. And the wind in the summer, spring, fall, winter, I mean, every damn season is intense. So I'm out here on August 15th on just an absolutely gorgeous evening. No wind. I got cicadas screaming at me like crazy, but you know what? That don't bother me. Well, at least it doesn't bother me. It may look like it bothers me, but hey, you know what? I got you. I got you. So that's nine points. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 14 plus 15 is 29. So 20. 1, 2, 3, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So I'm going to just attach it to my record of 29 so this green one right there that's going to be my uh, all-time record of washer throne that just sits on that damn board at 29 until i beat it so not going to do it tonight i've thrown 27 washers i'm only at 29 points so you ain't going to see a record this time but you know what you might see one tonight because i got at least an hour of daylight left and i mean it's as calm as it can be isn't it? Oh, 100% it is. So, rare breed. Enjoy it. Try it. If you haven't, if you're a bourbon person, dude, trust me. The rare breed is good. And again, it may not be your cup of tea. We'll discuss that later. I'll, or I will, I guess. I'm going to discuss how you uh, figure out what family a bottle is from. Uh, what distillery, where, you just, all these things you know to make educated decisions to find good bottles, but that will come later tonight. Oh, man. It may be getting dark, but the washer is the field game, and I can almost tell you right as, right as the washer leaves my hand, whether it's going in or not, and... I don't need the lights. All I need to be able to see is that damn box right there in the middle. Right there. Right? That's all you got to see. I'm going to see my girl Olive here for a second. That's right. I've had I've had quite a bit of bourbon tonight. Wild Turkey Rare Breed. I've had some Wild Turkey Kentucky Spirit. Both delightful. Check them out if you can get your hands on it. One, two, three, four, five points. Oh, this is brutal. Brutal. 5 plus 29 is 34. I've actually thrown 36 washers. This is my fourth round. So, uh, typically I'm I'm over getting one point per washer. I'm not throwing 50 washers each time. I, um, you may be say, saying to yourself, Ryan, hey, like the last few shows have been very long in terms of time. That's true, but a lot of that was just literally bourbon talk. If I would just shut up and shoot my washers, I can usually get through in about eight, eight, nine minutes. But <laughs> when I'm blabbing on, it's hard to, uh, it's hard to keep the pace up. So, all right, I'm at, uh, 34 points. I need 16. Let's really concentrate, see if I can get to 16. And honestly, no wind. These should all be damn near, damn near on online in the middle watch all oh, i wish you could see all this in the side can you no, not quite she loves watching the washers ah oh, this is brutal this is way too long this should be god this should be in the upper 20s maybe 30s lower 30s and uh not a washer thrown tough all right how are we going to distinguish this is on or not. All right, so we're going to just lift up the side here. So that one right there is not on. That one is. So I'm lifting it up. You can see it. So we're going to get three points for in the middle. Plus one, two, three, five on the outside. Oh, 
5 plus 34 is 39. I still need 11 points. I am... I'm bragging about how I almost never have to shoot 50 washers, but... <laughs> Let's see. 4 times 9, I believe, if my math is right. No, 5, five times 9. I've, I've done 5. Yeah. 45 washers, so I gotta... I gotta really make some in the middle to not make myself look like an idiot. Well, <laughs> I gotta do way more than that to make myself not look like an idiot. But you know what? It don't matter. Call, call a spade a spade, baby. Oh, Jesus. All right, concentration. I need 11 points. Three in, two on. Four in will do it as well. There's one on. Two on, three in, that's in. Ah, dang it. One in, two on, I got six points. Seven, eight, last washer. That's it, that's it, I gotta make it. I need 11, it's gotta go in the middle. Missed it, missed it by that much. Man, I need 11, I think I got nine. Let's see what we got here. One in the middle, that's three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, nine, nine, nine. Damn it. Damn it. This is way longer of a show than I thought. Nine plus 39 is 48. All right, I need two points. You know what, I'm just gonna pick up. See this washer right here? You know, pick that up. I'm gonna leave all that crap right there. Cause I need two points. And I'm not even going to set the uh, camera down on the uh, my JDT caddies, which are badass. I recommend them if you spend any time outside. The sucker's going to go right in the middle. Let me see. Get a good view. All right. You see it? Didn't go in, damn it. I need two more. It stayed on. I need two more points. All right. Here we go. Bird's eye view. There's one. All right, I got three points. Took me three washers for those last damn ones. God, I gotta get my uh, my throw down. I'm so loose. I'm feeling good, man. I'm I've had some nice wild turkey tonight, and it has been fantastic. And my shows have been way too long. I try to keep them under ten minutes, but damn it, ah, you get me going, you get too many wild turkey in me. You get too many bourbon in me. Damn it, I just. It just becomes too much, too much Ryan, not enough washers. Damn it. But you know what? I appreciate you spending 13 minutes with me. Even if you didn't spend 13 minutes with me. I appreciate you just checking out my show. Checking it out. So, you know what? I'm going to have one more in me for sure. Still light enough. Oh, it's calm. It's beautiful. Nature is a mincing from around so come join me for at least one more show before I turn on the fire and and just sit and talk bourbon join me for all of them yeah here you go come back and see me thanks for thanks for watching whiskey and washers I am Ryan your host oh find good bourbon and if you don't know how, yeah, hopefully I can uh, teach you one, two, maybe three things to help your uh, bourbon hunting out. See you soon.